My name's Robbie Ballinger. I'm a plant-based ultra-endurance athlete, and I just like to run. My father died when I was really young, so through that, I think I've always been on this exploration of what it means to be a man. I think the most healthy way is to push myself physically. Running for me is this great way for me to explore myself and what I'm capable of, and at the end of the day, it's just you against yourself. You just gotta keep pushing and finding who you are through hard efforts. Two years ago, I ran across the United States. I was 3,175 miles. I did it in 75 days, so 43 miles a day. And the point of it was to create conversations about better food choices and promote just the efficacy of a plant-based diet. It's the best thing I can do for my body to perform at my highest level. This challenge is about me. It's about pushing my limits. It's about showing what's possible in a plant-based diet. And that's why I'm heading to New York. This feat of strength is really gonna challenge me. It's gonna push me to my limit. In order to prepare for that, I've just been focusing on consistency, uh, getting up, getting after it every day. Being here in Denver, the winters can be pretty rough, but I choose to use that to my advantage. It's what gets me up, I get going every day, I push even when I don't want to. I make sure to run at least 10 miles a day, and that's regardless of weather, schedule, it has to get done. One of the advantages of a plant-based diet from an athlete's standpoint is its digestibility. It takes less for my body to process, therefore more of that energy gets to go to my legs. So late in the game, I'm not as worn out. The food choices, the mental grit, and the conditioning that I've put myself through over the last couple months are the things that are gonna help me to push through, finish strong, and crush this record. So we're here at Central Park, it's 6 a.m., about five minutes I'll start this thing. It's pretty cold, but i uh, got about 19 hours of running ahead of me. It'll be good to go. Finish lap four, 24 miles in. He is 33 minutes ahead of goal pace. And loops in, one more for the tie, two for the win. I just set the record for most loops around Central Park in a day. That's 12 of them. <laughs> Now I'm gonna go do a few more.